the exam. Or do you remember mm. when is our exam? When? Mm -hmm. Oh, interesting. What about the rest? Jesse and Karen, do you remember? No, teacher. Huh. I don't well, remember. You need to remember stuff. Okay. Take a note. We said in previous months, well, four weeks ago, that we need to to continue with listening and speaking practices, remember? Because that was the the lowest um, score in the exam. Yes, it did. Right? So we haven't finished the 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 review section, like the um I want to see how many topics we can cover in two months. So technically this month there's not going to be an exam up to the next month. And the next month we are going to do a simulation again, but only well, the full simulation again. Right? The B1 intermediate simulation. If we pass this exam in in October, then we go directly to the B2 training. So I want you to be super attentive with the vocabulary, practice the words that we are saying, um, uh, correct your mistakes, everything that we are training so we can pass successfully on October, well, on November for, sorry, to, to the next level. Do you okay. understand? Mm -hmm. Right, so that's the plan. We pass this exam on October, so we can start B2 on November, in November. Agreed? Okay, teacher. Yeah. All right, girls. So it's on you. Learn vocabulary, reuse your vocabulary, do everything as we planned. Let's go, girls. We have... This topic we saw last class, we saw topic three, we saw about apologizing and who didn't receive feedback on Friday? Who didn't, negative. Everybody received? Yes. Really? Yes. Cool. Oh, perfect. Super effective. So in that case, let's go to... The next level. Young and homeless. Let's go. Speaking number one. Young and homeless, where is it? Okay. Let's read. The following expressions, okay? Young and homeless. We are going to open this conversation with some idiomatic expressions, okay? Idiomatic expressions to talk about homeless and conversation. To do something a big something is equals to say to try hard. Complete these phrases using the following words. Here we go, Em.
What do you say? To something, a big something is similar to say to try hard. Jessica's more. Let's begin with you. Maybe to to have a big effort. Girl, the word effort is correct, but the word may. Uh, what do you say? Have make. <laughs> 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 you are so intelligent. Very good. Eh? <laughs> you got me. Okay. I had uh, six. I had six. Uh -huh. Half boots. Yeah, so you I... said half, but I, you, I said <laughs> my... Yeah, you to know make... me. You know me, girl. Very, very bad. It, it, that's the to... negative part about having too many, too many classes. You start <laughs> knowing my my reactions. Sorry, so to make a big effort. You are correct. That's is correct. You to try hard. It's equal to try hard. That's correct. Try hard is the definition. And to make a big effort, this is the cookie, the idiomatic yes. expression. Okay? Oh. Yes. Take a note in your glossary. Okay. Okay. Very good, girl. Excellent, let's go with the next one. Learning vocabulary by context. Rocks. To space in space with somebody. This is equal to say to contact. To contact mm. somebody. Uh, uh, maybe time in the second space. In time? Incorrect. Mm -hmm. Also, the word time is not in the options, eh? Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, to get? To get? In... Life to get in life or to touch get in life is correct, but life no. To get in to hunt in no, mm -mm. no, to get in. In something, no? You gave me one. Let's keep it over here. Let's see if Karen can help you. Okay. Karen, action. I know. Did you to get in turn? No. In turn. Wrong. Mm -mm. Because you get in turn. That doesn't make sense. I don't remember. Yes. Oh, okay. Somebody say touch. Nobody said touch. Uh, to Transition. Touch. Touch. Exactly. Touch. And you are correct. To get in touch. Touch. Okay. That's right. Example. I get in touch with the people I love. I get in touch with my friends. I contact my friends. I get in touch with my with my family when I have good news, for example. Okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's it. The last one. Oh no, you gave me examples. Mm -hmm. So Rox. Who do you get in touch with when you 
need good advice. Who do you get in touch with when you need good advice? Maybe my sister uh, uh, to get in touch. Mm -mm. Person get in touch with person two. My sister. Switch. Switch people. Teacher. Can you repeat the 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 Pleasure. explain no the uh, the meaning? Oh yeah, like the meaning is to contact a person, not like to call, to send them a message, to to send them WhatsApp or Facebook or call mm -hmm. them. Okay, you know? mm -hmm. that's to contact. So, who do you contact when you need good advice? Who do uh, you? Get in touch with when you need good advice. Ooh. When I need advance advice, mm -hmm. uh, uh, to get in touch. In who? Person, verb, complement. By the way, get in touch is a verb. Yes. So when I, when I when I need uh, advice, uh -huh. my sister. Mm. Switch. Switch people. Uh, my sister, okay. Um, my sister. No, not your sister. Who do you? Who do you? Ah, I. Yes, exactly. Oh. Uh -huh. Who? Who do you get in touch with when you need good advice? Uh, when I need to get no, when I need uh, to get advice. Okay. Uh, I get in touch Yes. With my sister. With my sister. Okay. Now, listen to the question and check how I never said an advice. Okay. You know, listen. Who do you get in touch with when you need good advice? Copy paste. When I need good advice? Yes. Copy paste. Mm. Oh, teacher, when I need mm -hmm. to get, mm -hmm. to get. Copy when paste. I need good advice. Exactly. When I need good advice. I. Get in touch with my sister. Yes, that's the way. That's the way. This way, Brox, you are going to avoid Spanglish. Okay, teacher. You see, that's the best way to, to avoid wrong uh, construction. Yes, I need practice this. Let's do this. Okay. We are going to practice like that. Thank you, promise. So... Copy that example in the chat, including question and answer. Both. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can, you can. Okay, okay. Right, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Jessica's more. When do you make, when do you need to make a big effort? Like what's the most difficult thing to do for you? 
I make a bit effort when I I have to go to the gym. Yes. Um I have to work leg. You have to work what? Um, leg. Leg? Uh, yes. Day leg. Ah no no no. You have to do leg day. No day leg. I have to do leg day. Exactly. Where? I, uh, in the uh, at the gym. At the gym. You need to say at the gym because if you don't mention the gym, I don't have context about doing leg. You know what I mean? All right. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes, Try I again. make. I make a big effort when it's leg day. Yes. At the gym. When, when it is. It is. When it is leg day. Correct. At the gym. At the gym. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Copy question and answer in the chat. Mm -hmm. What is... Uh, what is my... Is the question? What is my... Uh -uh. I, again. When do you have to do oh, to make? When do you have to make a big effort? Okay, thank you. The next one, Erin. Who do you get in touch when you need a good advice? Uh oh, rocks Spanglish. When do you get in touch? No. Who do you get in touch with? Who do you get in touch with? Okay. Mm -hmm. When you need good advice, not a good advice. Okay. Who did you get in touch with when you need good advice? When I need a good advice, uh oh, one more time. You said a good advice. And it's with comma it rocks. When I need a good when I when I need good advice, comma. I get in touch with my sister because it's not two separate ideas. It's only one. When do you have to make a big effort? I make a big effort when it's like day at the gym. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Karen, give me two words to complete the phrase, to make the phrase similar to, to talk to somebody. Talk somebody mm. to mm. to give no. to give what uh, to give a word no <laughs> to give a word you are close. You are close. The word is word. Uh, okay. To to have. Yes. Yes. Don't say no. <laughs> okay. You are guessing. Yes. You are guessing. That's okay. Okay. <laughs> to have a word. When you have a word with somebody. You say, hey, can I have a word? Okay. Excuse me, can I have a word? When I need the good advice, I get in touch. Ah, exactly. Much better. It's different to get that advice, teacher, or is similar? To get advice. 
Yeah, to get advice is super different. Okay. Because get advice is to, ah, uh, when somebody gives you tips. Ah, uh, okay. And in this case, it's just talk. Mm, okay. You know? In this case, for example, if your boss tells you, hey, can I have a word? You should be worried. Uh, okay. <laughs> You know? Okay. That's that's not something you want to hear. Okay. No. <laughs> so, Karen. Yes. Who did you have a word with and why? Who did you have a word with and why? Who did you have? Yes. Who did you have a word with? And why? why? Okay. I have a word mm -hmm. with my manager mm -hmm. because we have uh, problems with the housekeepers. Uh oh, a problem? Or problems. We have a problems. We have problems with the housekeepers. Good. Uh, in the job. Uh oh, in no. the job. In the work. Work. Not any. What is the connector for a specific location? At work. Yes, you know perfectly. Okay. Uh -huh. Complete. Okay, I have a word with my manager because mm -hmm. we have problems with the housekeepers. Oh, wait. Are you talking about every day? Mm, no. We we had <laughs> Yes. Sorry. Um, I, I I don't remember the first part. <laughs> I, I worry, have I worry, concentration focus. I have a word with my manager. Because... Have a word every day? No. I had a word with my manager yes. because we had problems with the housekeepers at work. Excellent. <laughs> ah, that's a good correction. Okay. Yes. Copy Thank question you. and answer in the chat. Who did yes. you had have a word with and why? Who did you have a word with and why? Rux. The next one. Here's if I'm not happy. Um, maybe to do um, have the time, yes, of your life. You are so correct, mm. very mm. good. To have the time of your life. That's correct. It's. I hope you say al revés. To have the, to have the help or to have the time. Oh, sorry. To have the time of your life. I thought you was the opposite way. No, opposite way. Okay. Uh -huh. Good, 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 good. So, when, when do you think you will have the time of your life? Or have you ever had the time of your life? Can you repeat the question, please? Sure. When do you think you will have the time of your life? Mm. 
Uh, I, I, I don't understand the question because you are you are uh, asking mm -hmm. when um, when do when do you think mm -hmm. uh, no when do you think no when well when do you think you will have the time of your life the time of your life Ah, oh, okay. Uh -huh. Or uh, maybe have you uh -huh. ever in the past? No. Uh -huh, uh -huh. No, I I understand. Um, in fact, I don't think uh there there is a special uh time of my life. Okay. Uh, but if I I had to choose, mm -hmm. maybe 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 was in the high school. Interesting. Maybe was in the high school. Yes. Okay. Um. Use the expression. If maybe, I have to choose. Mm -hmm. uh, if I had to choose uh, the best time of my life, not. Okay, yes. yes. You omitted half, but, but uh, try to use half. These are verbs. Uh, maybe... Let, let me what let happened me... in high school in or the high school in mm -hmm. high school mm -hmm. I have the time of my life exactly that's correct it's, it's a little confused uh, confusing confusing use uh that long that large sen sentences yes. That's correct. Mm -hmm. Because and also and also because the word have it doesn't mean tener. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Exactly. Yes. Okay. That's precisely the point. Mm -hmm. Copy. <laughs> copy, copy. <laughs> you can start in you can start in uh, if I have to choose. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Jessica has more. Yes. Here we go. This expression means to help somebody. To help somebody? Yes. Um, to... To give mm -hmm. somebody mm -hmm. a, a hand. Very good. That's so good. To give, to give somebody, somebody a hand is equal to help somebody. I agree with you. Mm -hmm. Help me, yes. When was the last time you gave somebody a hand? Maybe no physical. It mm -hmm. it it was not um a health physical a uh, physical health. Mm -hmm. mm, but I follow um I follow a guy that helps um, homeless dogs. That helps homeless. Ah, homeless dogs. Yeah. Homeless, no home. 
homeless. Yeah. Dogs. So uh, sometimes he asks for help them. Ooh. So when I call to he asks for what? He asks uh -huh. for help. For help. If you say for help, help is not a is not a verb. Mm, so you cannot for... say help them. So to you know help he uh -huh. asked okay. for he asked for the hands. He asked for a hand. Interesting. Continue. Um, because uh, he didn't have enough <laughs> food to um, to oh, I forgot the 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 word to say alimentarlos. Well, to... ask me the magic question. How do you say alimentarlos? Feed. 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 Yes, yes. He didn't have enough money to feed the dogs. Uh -huh. And you? So, I, give, I gave uh -huh. a donation. Uh -huh. You gave? I gave a, a hand. Mm -hmm. The word somebody a... replaces with a pronoun. I gave him a hand. Yes, exactly. That's correct. Mm -hmm. Copy that example. Okay. Watch out, Rox. It was, if I had to choose in high school, I had. Not the high school. Okay, I okay. You know? Mm -hmm. In high school I have. And the last one, bonus cookie. to turn a blind eye equals to say to ignore something or somebody did you get it this is not necessary because it's b2 but if you want to write it write it no problem Any question? No, did you? Good. So, opening, speaking. Try to use these expressions to tell a story about a time you had to help somebody in need. Say, who did you help? What happened? To this person, 
and how did you help them? And how you? Are you ready, girls? Let's spin the wheel. Who goes first? Let's go. Oh my God. <laughs> so, so you always start in this one. That's super cool. So yes. Wait, 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 wait! I'm not recording. I'm not recording. Okay. Three, two. No, but one. stop, please. Oh. I have to to say a story with this. Try to yeah. use this expression to tell about a time you have to help. Correct. You can talk about the guy who who helped hold this dot. Tell me the complete story. Mm, all right. Okay. I will say. Yes. Three, two, one, two minutes. Yes. I follow um guy and he he helped homeless dogs. Dogs. So one day uh, he he wrote a tweet that he needed to to feed the dogs because the foods because he didn't have enough foods so uh, who um, as um, like he's an independent person, so he asks for money usually, and then a uh, uh, he. He spent his time uh, oh, I, I don't know. He spent his time giving food to these dogs that didn't have um, that don't have a home. Um, so he, oh, I don't know. So you helped him? Yes, I tried to help him when I, I can't. And um, I tried to give him a hand with Mm, some money. Time's up. Time's up. Oh, okay. Anyway, thank you very much. You're welcome. Let me send it to you. Okay. Jessica's more. All right. Next person. Aaron, let's go. Okay. Three, 
two, one, action. Okay. Um, I had a work with my manager, the same example, uh, because we had problems with the housekeeper at work, especially with Jenny. Jenny had a lot of problems with her family and and I had and and I tried to give uh, her a hand uh, with this problem because his daughter was so sick and he need um he need he need uh, talk a doctor but I because he don't work with concentration. He does didn't work with concentration about this problem with his daughter. Um, I don't know. Let me another time. <laughs> uh, when I need an advice, I try to get in touch with um uh, with my manager because. Uh, he had the best decision about these problems. And in this time, I need to one advice about Jenny, uh, because Jenny is a good housekeeper at work. And I need that Jenny feels better, will be will be better <laughs> I, think, yeah, I don't know um, and I enjoy to help people like Jenny uh, at work but every decision needs an advice we and talk with the manager about these examples especially with the housekeepers problems with their uh, families in this case, with Jenny. Yes. Very good. Okay. Where's Karen? Mm -hmm. And feedback. Last but not least, rocks. Okay, teacher. <laughs> you can, girl. One, two, three. Oh, wait, wait. Uh -huh. Three, two, one, go. Um, one time I was on subway and I noticed that a woman, a blind, blind woman, uh, was scared because she didn't uh, get up in the station, stop station. And I realized uh, that she was she was scared uh, and the woman uh, turned a blind eye uh, and I think uh, I I need to do something and uh, I I decide uh, to give her a hand, and I I went with with she to the uh, correct station, and I I wait. Uh, with him, uh, even the subway arrived, and and that's all, teacher. 
very good. I didn't activate the clock, but I was <laughs> yes. watching the recording. And look, okay. one minute, 56. So no okay. problem. Very interesting. And, and everybody ignored her. Yes. Mm -hmm. Society. Very good, girls. Please study your listenings, your speakings, and pay attention to the notes I gave you. Okay? I'll see you tomorrow for part two. All right. Thank you, Thank you Mr. Thank All right, you girls. Know. I'll see you later. See you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.